I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of insight on what we're doing for the coating. So we've got DNA DNX in this little transfer bottle. We've got a new applicator right here. Now, all we wanna do is put a little bit of product here on the applicator and we've already got it primed, so it's ready to go. Uh, and now we're gonna do about a two by two foot section. Now, here's how you wanna do it. So we're gonna create a box and then we're gonna fill in that box. So it's almost like you're coloring in a shape. So we're gonna start up top with like this. We're gonna move over. We're gonna move down, go down to the bottom and then come back up. So once we've got our shape outlined, we're just gonna fill in that square. And this is gonna make it super simple. So once we've got that square filled in, now we can just kind of rub that coating into the pores. So where a lot of people go wrong is they just like to move it really gently across the surface, but you actually wanna push that coating into the pores so that it has the best bond possible. So once we've got it pushed in really well, that's gonna be it. Now our coating is actually curing pretty fast. It's gonna rainbow over pretty fast. So we're actually ready to wipe it off right now. So we're gonna start here with our first towel. We're gonna do our first wipe, fold it into fours. And we're just gonna kind of move that coating, kind of even it out. We wanna get it even across the entire surface so that if we miss any spots, it's gonna cover that up. So now that we've got it pretty well, pretty much even across the entire surface, we can really start to kind of go at the coating and really start to get it off because we want to get this coating completely off the gel coat. Now, it's super important to have a plush microfiber because this is going to allow the coating to um, get into all the fibers of our towel and really take it off the boot. So super important here. Now we're going to do a couple more passes. You've really got to be focused and you've got to be ready to go when you're coating because you cannot miss any spots on the boat when you're wiping off. So it's super important to pay attention to what you're doing. All right, so our first wipe is going to be done. Now we've got to do one more towel. This is our finishing towel. This is going to make sure that we have completed everything and we've got everything off of the boat. So this towel should be a lot easier to move. It should be a lot easier to take off any of that excess coating. Now where you really wanna pay attention is on these two sides. So we've coated to that end, we've coated to this end. We wanna make sure that we really wipe off these ends so that we don't have this showing as we continue down the boat. Occasionally, you're going to want to reflip over your towel, get a new edge to work with. And then you're going to notice that your towel is going to be super easy to glide back and forth. That means that you've got all the coating off of the boat. And just like that.